everyone, and welcome to the first episode of Just Synthetic Organic. Today, we'll be taking a brief look at some chiral auxiliaries used for alpha alkylation. Now on the left column, we have auxiliaries for carboxylic acid derivatives. We've got Meyer's pseudoephedrine, Evans' oxazolidinone, and Opolzer's camphor sultan. And they're all derived from natural products, alkaloids, amino acids, and terpenes. In addition, there's Ender's reagent, useful for ketones and aldehydes. So once the auxiliary has been bound to the substrate, you use LDA, an alkylate that enolate diastereoselectively. Afterwards, you cleave the auxiliary with hydrolysis, or in the case of Ender's hydrozone, ozonolysis. Now let's take a brief look at the synthesis of Evans oxazolidinone. The target molecule is heterocyclic with a 1,2 amino alcohol and a 1,1 carbonic acid derivative. So if we disconnect the one carbon A1 fragment, we can head back to L-valenol. Diethyl carbonate serves as the A1 reagent. L-valenol in turn is obviously made from L-valine, which we reduce with lithium aluminum hydride, or alternatively, a borane THF complex, which in turn can be made from THF, sodium borohydride, and the oxidizing agent iodine. And now a question for you. Can you find A1 synthons besides diethyl carbonate used for oxazolidinone synthesis in the literature? Thanks, and see you next time with Ender's reagent synthesis.